All right, people, what's up, everyone? This is a very impromptu video, very impromptu. I was about to record something else, and then I saw this on my Twitter, and I was like, screw that other video. I need to do this right now. Uh, Limited Run Games already said that they're doing a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles uh, Shredder's Revenge physical copy, and they also said there was going to be a collector's edition, and there's going to be two collector's editions, I think they said. They usually do this. They usually do a classic edition like this one, and then they do a like a mega collector's edition. Um, so I'm assuming, I just saw this, I barely looked at it, and I was like, I need to do a video, I have it r right here, so let's just, let's just take a look, don't cut Shredder no slack, the Shredder's Revenge Classic Edition will include classic Turtles VHS style packaging, I saw that, and me like, I need to make this, that's amazing, look at it, it looks so good, oh, it's like, this, it's so, ah, that's great, that's so good, uh, Steelbook, sticker set, uh, that's for the, the Switch, obviously, oh, wait, hold on, all right, no, let's click on it, all right, I'm sorry, this is a very all over the place video. Oh, this is very first impressions. All right, oh, perfect. Okay, this is perfect. All right, Collector's Edition 7 right there. It even says right there, 7. There's got to be, because it's going to be 2. Wait, that doesn't make any sense, because it, it's coming to, well, it's coming to Xbox. It's coming to Xbox Switch and, and PS4. So, that makes sense. Two, two different Collector's Edition. Okay, it makes sense. But what's the, the seventh one? That's... All right. Oh, my God. 200 Oh, no. Oh, no, my money. No. 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 My poor wallet. You poor son of a bitch. Oh, no. Switch. All right. I just want to look at the... Oh, that's so good. Here's the Xbox. Oh, no, that's PS4. Xbox. What's the seventh one? I don't... Oh, it's PC. Oh, oh, okay. PC. Okay. I will take a look at that actually in a minute too. I think it's probably gonna be the same. Um, all right. We got to take, oh, uh, uh, I'll probably get it. I don't know what I'm going to get on. Probably, probably switch. Cause I'll buy the game when it comes out on, on Xbox most likely. So I'll probably get it on switch, but let's look at the Xbox version anyway. Look at this box. Look at that box. Look at that box. It looks better here. It's transparent background. So they can't. All right. All right. Let me see what you close. Oh my God. That's oh, that's too much, dude. It comes with a, it comes with it comes with a little arcade thing. It comes with a personal pan pizza. We already knew that because of the little run, dude. It comes with a shell, like a little like like figure. Oh my god, it's so good. I'll never take it out of that. That'll always be on my wall, dude. The steel book, the game better be in the steel book and just put the regular case in there, <laughs> please. Uh, Shredder's Revenge. Oh my god, it comes with Shadow Box Strategy Guide. Okay. I'm such a cuck for this shit. Uh, Shredder. Okay, a <laughs> Shredder toy. I knew there, go there was going to be a figure of some sort in there. I think that's in the classic one, was it? Or was it not? I don't know. Stickers, of course. That comes with every copy, I think. 200, a strategy guide, a shadow box. That shadow box is sick, by the way. Uh, a soundtrack, a poster, steelbook, Shredder figure, uh, stickers, a little fucking shredder like little one of those little like arcade one-up things or something not, not the big ones but i don't think arcade one-up makes those but those little here i have one hold on let me get it real quick like one of these things i have a miss pac-man one here like this that's kind of cool these are like 30 dollar things anyway and if they made that in real life i would have fucking bought it instantly so that i love that wait i'm a little confused because it looks like for this one it comes with a steelbook another case it comes with three cases for the same game because it has this which is the outer box i get that's the outer box okay that's probably gonna have the stickers and stuff like that okay uh and the poster probably and the soundtrack maybe um and then this is just a re regular game and then the, oh my god is it please tell me this isn't limited i i will shit a brick if it is oh i'm actually i'm running out of breath <laughs> is it cool because they just they just do uh doesn't say Products are typically not expected to ship until eight to nine months after. <laughs> oh God! Oh, I'm gonna spend over two hundred dollars on some shit. I'm probably not gonna get until I'm dead. Imagine I die. Period. That'd suck. Anyway. Wow! Look at this stuff. Look. Oh, this is better. This is a better image. I should just use this. Dude, two hundred dollars. But look at the stuff you get. Look at this. You get that cool ass fucking VHS thing. You get the strategy guide. You get a steel book. You get a poster, which is going to be folded up, which sucks, so you can't frame it. I mean, can it'll just look like shit. Oh, plays the game's trailer? Oh, that's awesome. Plays video and sound only. Okay, that's that's fine. Actually, that's really funny. Oh, my God, that trailer's so good with Mike Patton doing the vo the vocals. The sh I love shadow boxes. I'm still waiting for my Castlevania. Where's that? 
Huh? I'm waiting for it. Anyway, uh, Shredder. There's the plastic, the blister box packaging. Reversible cover, so you have a different cover. Uh, and then a parcel pan pizza, which is amazing. It's actually a legitimately a legitimate one. They said it during the Limit Run Games press conference. I should have put that as the, a separate reaction because that was so, so good. Um, I'm buying. I'm this is bought. It's, uh, dude, the box itself alone, having that just somewhere, would be amazing. Uh, I have never been this excited to spend two hundred dollars. Uh, let's take a look at just see what you get for the regular one. So you get. You get the the box, which is cool. You get the steel book, which is good because people get really annoyed when they put the steel book for the 200, 180, 190, 150 fucking collector's edition, 150 dollar collector editions. Uh, so you only get the steel book because the stickers and I want to say the personal pan pizza come with the regular game. So the only thing you're getting new is the outer box, which is the VHS thing, which is cool. And then the wait, how is a How's an Xbox and PS4 game going to fit inside this outer box? Because a VHS tape is skinnier than a... Maybe it's not an outer box for this. Maybe it's not an outer box, period. Hold on. Let me see. There should be another... Yeah, here we go. It's just a box. It says VHS style box. So you get just a box. And then all this other stuff comes separately with it? Because there's no way that this is going to fit inside a VHS. But unless the box is bigger than a VHS tape i guess it could be but i would figure they would make it vs vhs shaped i mean that's cool it's not i mean that's really cool i like that but uh god the fucking collector's edition this one good lord the strategy guide i might have to get it on switch like i feel like i, I kind of want to get it on xbox just because they don't make xbox stuff but and also it won't have the stupid ass switch logo on the front which I love that PS4 and, and I guess now Xbox doesn't have that. But like, look, the Switch version, that's kind of why I don't want to click that one. But uh, let me see, I can't go back. Wait, was that it? No, it's PS4. Can, can you? All right, thank you. Uh, oh, yeah, let's take a look at this uh, this one. But like the Switch one's going to have like, they Switch has to have their fucking stupid logo on it. I don't know why, but they, they have to. It's, a, it's, a, it's against law not to have it. As is tradition. But look, PS4 doesn't have the logo on it, which is cool. I mean, when it comes out, it might have the logo on it. Who knows? But uh, I bought... Uh, what did I buy that didn't have it? And I was happy about it. Um, I want to say I, I bought something for PS4 in hopes that it wouldn't have the logo, and it didn't. I can't remember now. Anyway, just to have a presentation piece. You know, just a big thing. All right, so what does this come with? Anything different? Uh, is it coming up? Oh, okay, because of a mouse pad. Oh, and it comes with a little USB thing and a, and a soundtrack. Okay, that's not bad for five dollars less too. I mean, I guess you just get a digital copy. That's probably the game's probably on the USB. Actually, that's kind of funny. Um, if it is, I'm assuming it is. Uh, your PC copy of TNA will not be included inside the PC big. It will ship separately within the same order. Okay, will ship separately. It's a weird. You mean just send us? You just gotta send it. PC jewel case, USB stick. How many? How, how, how big the size? I always have products and not one one scale. Okay. Uh, size steelbook, PC on CD. Game. Oh, game included for easy install. I'm confused now. Your PC cover will not be included inside the PC cover. In the same order. Okay, so. So the USB won't be included at first. That's very strange. Anyway, <laughs> I'm, 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 I'm confused about that. Anyway, I thought that'd be fun, and it was. I had a good time. Anyway, there we go. Uh, that's the uh, TMNT, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Shredder's Revenge, Big Box Edition. Is that what it was called? Whatever. I didn't even look. The Limited Radical Edition. I even noticed the name. That's good. Anyway, that's it. Bye. <laughs>